Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on converting a percentage to a decimal. Now to convert a percentage to a decimal, there's just one thing we need to remember, and that's that we divide by 100. So let me write it there. So if we had 3%, we want to do 3 divided by 100. Now to divide by 100, you move the decimal point two places to the left. Now at the moment, we don't have a decimal point, but we know that it occurs just after the units digit. Now I can't really move it left at the moment because I've got no digits on the front, but we might as well just put zeros because we have three units, we have zero tens, we have zero hundreds. There's nothing wrong with putting zeros on the front. So now by dividing by 100, I can move this decimal point two places to the left because 100 has two zeros. And now we've got 0 0.03. So let me just write that clearly without that decimal point at the end. It's just 0 0.03. What about the second one? 40%. So as I said, we divide by 100 to convert to a decimal. So 40 divided by 100. Well, if we write the 40 here, at the moment the decimal point is at the end, just after the units digit, and then it moves one place two places, the decimal points now here, and obviously we put a zero on the front as the units digit. And we don't need that zero on the end, it's just 0 0.4. And finally, 103%. Again, we just take 103 and we divide it by 100. Don't worry about the fact that this is more than 100%, there's nothing wrong with that. So if we write the 103 with the decimal point at the end, it moves one place, and then two places, and we get 1.03. And you should have a sense that this feels right, because 100% is equal to a whole. And that means that if we have something just more than 100%, so 103% is just more than 100%, then as a decimal, we should have something that's just a bit more than one. And indeed, 1.03 is just a bit more than one, so it kind of feels right. Just like 40% here, for example, that's sort of roughly half of something. And 0.4 is roughly a half, so it feels just about right. 